Welcome back. My name is Kaz. And I am Kiwi. And this is Odin Sphere. Indeed. And oh, this time, we're going to hell. We're, well, Vulcan on. Uh, Vulcan? It, yeah, it means volcano. Please tell me, where is he gone? He went to the Fire Kingdom to fulfill a promise he made to the king there. He's been gone for some time now. Something may have happened. To fulfill a promise? What is happening in the Fire Kingdom? My heart aches with each passing day. I cannot bear it. I cannot wait like this. The great King Onyx is just ahead. Busty. Welcome, Princess of Ragnanum. It I has like been a guy. while, Your Majesty. You are as beautiful as ever. Tis always a pleasure to welcome you to our kingdom. This way, please, allow us to entertain you. Your Majesty. I have come here seeking answers. I have heard that my husband Oswald has come to this land. Are you aware of this? As much as I would like to say that I am not, I cannot lie in the face of such beauty. Oh, you smoothie. He is certainly yeah, I know. here. He is fighting for me. Fighting? Yes. Against a dragon that is terrorizing our country. Some say it's that this huge. dragon is Leventhan, the one mentioned in the prophecies concerning the world's end. Our fire and our swords have had no effect on this newborn dragon. I thought his Belder Reaver may have some effect. But since I have heard no news, I assume it was useless as well. Why Oswald? You may not know this, but King Odin had already promised your hand to me. It would have helped unify both our countries. But your father went back on his word, and instead gave you to that tortured soul. In compensation for letting the issue drop quietly, Oswald made me a promise. He vowed to fight for his life on my behalf whenever I asked. Oswald wow. did this for me? He may die. He may even already be dead. I can void our agreement and save him if you will be my bride. It's up to you. Gwendolyn, as long as you become mine. Wow. Oh, you Inferno smooth. Inferno King, you are <laughs> no different than the men back home. I am not an object. What? Get her, Vulcans. Capture her, but don't harm her. Yowza. See, if you had... Like flame chicks, why would you need anything else? I know. <laughs> Look I'm, how busty they I mean, are! They turn into fire! I don't, know, I don't really know what the uh, what Onyx's tastes are exactly. He always talks like he's talking to a whole huge audience. I don't know what I like about him. Welcome! Everyone! Welcome to my kitchen! So this like, is where I create food! Like Winterhorn Ridge, the Lava Pit Vulcanon has a fire effect on it, or a weather effect on it. This time it's fire and you need the fireproof charm. Another 100 gold out of pocket with that. And again, it has little uh, wisp guys. This time, instead of reaching the ground, they float up to the ceiling and away, and then they die. It's really Kinda nice neat, that huh? you got the flame charm. I was, through both of those uh, <laughs> elemental places, I had to drink 
Yeah, I, ooh, man. I would not do this again without without the charms. I was I was You so can cheap. Uh, like Kiwi said, you can get a potion to put a cooling effect on you and negate it is the called damage cooler. for a while. It's called cooler. Potion C. Potion C for So I guess that's off. Yeah, that's what Chilling a, a refreshing out. high C. <laughs> it's a little drink oh. pouch. Be careful of those things. Those are bombs. Mm -hmm. Like the bombs that you, uh, what are they called in, uh, in Final Fantasy? I, I guess just bombs or grenades. Yeah, bombs or grenades. Yeah, they can choose not to die, like this guy. See how zeros are popping out of him? He doesn't have any hit points left. He just keeps popping around. If they explode, you take a ton of damage. It is ridiculous. I want to say if, uh, that if two of them explode right next to you and you take damage from both, you just cannot live. It's uh, that much you die. damage. Incidentally, <laughs> it's pretty bad. Don't die. Ah, Don't next do up that. is the mini boss. Well, what would the mini boss be? It's one of those Vulcans, the fire oh, chick. Sexy Vulcans. Yes. They have a lot of weird attacks, and it's really hard to get a lot of damage in on them at once because they're, you know, they're little chicks and their oh, no, what's hitboxes that? are small. She oh, the, lizard the lizards? Ah, uh, the lizards aren't that much of a hassle. They're probably the uh, least threatening enemies in the whole dungeon. Not when there's like 15 of them. Whatever. Okay, I admit, they can sort of gank you out of nowhere. If it's the kind that are spitting huge green orbs at you. Yeah. 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 These are not there's that big. One, there's that one spot. Like, one of those maps. There's, like, a couple of those. Was I want to so say it's the five-star map in this. It just has a ton of lizards. And they are... Yeah. Son of a bitch. You know what these Vulcans remind me of? Remember the uh, the Hellion bitches that were wa wagging their butts in you know, Grimmer? Yeah. They remind me of that. <laughs> they were the towers. Anyway, when you beat one of them, they turn to stone and then crumble. So long! Goodbye. Master Kaz, you have beaten this, and what grade do you get? A B. This place is barbaric, that's what this is. Barbaracy. It's simply barbaric. That's why everything's in hell. Like barbaric. everyone's all naked. Barbaric. Oh my gosh. Na Naples? Naples. Naples. An apple. Plus a what? Well, there's some grapes in there. I mean, I've been making all kinds of things. They dropped tons of Naple seeds in this place. So I don't know why. Yeah, I know, right? I still haven't thrown anything at people. Like, I really like to throw objects, like, after oh, really? them. Yeah. Oh, but they also I guess make we should really try good, that next uh, time. They also make a really good uh, fusion sort of thing. Yeah, like, I mean, they, any they one of them really is good cool. for increasing the number of your, of your material. And that's, that's nice. almost Especially always what bones. I use them for. The bones, bones at are three. Good. Yeah. Bones at three. Bones. So you may have noticed a couple of the uh, habaneristos than you. Oh, no. yeah. <laughs> it's quite rare to see a human in this area. It'll be a bit expensive, but I'll sell you something if you want. Oh, oh those goblins. Yeah, the Hobbin Uristo is the new Madrigora. It's the fifth. It's the only one that can harm you. They will breathe fire at you if you let them. So you gotta kill them fast. You know, I should let one get me sometime and, and show that. I didn't ever do that with Glimmer. They will, they will just like pop them in and go, heh <laughs> heh, blah, and breathe fire at you. Oh, you sold it off. Well, I get a ton of them around here. And besides, I was just trying to make bank for my large bag. I still can't believe that. Oh. No. We buy Valentinian gold. It's worth it for the bag. I know, I have to keep my objectives up. Da, 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 da. How many bags uh, can you have? Six. So I'm one away from maximum. You're on number five, sir. 
And then, you know, inventory management ensues, so off we go. And the next place to go and uh, hurt the things. I the green lizards. Those are the ones that can the ones that can spit the large green fire orb things at you. Fireballs exactly these you know, Ugh. Chunky rocks. I really hate those things when they're like so a lot. And they are hard sometimes to beat when there is a lot of them jumping all around. I do not like those grenades. Oh, here no, we go. Here this is, a, is this is the one. Here's a shload really of lizards. So long. <laughs> I usually like to cycle in them or funnel them. It's like the same little thing I like to do with a lot of my enemies. Like get, get them collected. Oh gosh, these are yeah. Even more Having dangerous. a lot of the green ones around are way more dangerous. They have multiple moves. They can you know, part the fire at you like that. They have like a backflip move that they can do. Even worse than that is the fact that these bombs are with them. The bombs are with you. At least you got money out of it. Get him! Stay at a safe distance. And there we go. I didn't realize at first what was going on, but that was the five star area. That was like really? peanuts compared to some of the other, uh, the other maps five-star areas. Just because yeah. the lizards are so passive. They're like, yeah, we'll fight you, but we're kind of, you know. Wimpy. We like running around. See, so running. So you're going to boss? Or are you going to... Oh, not yet. I have to Rosalind. clear out every map. It's important to go after every map. Because if you don't, you might miss out on some cooking recipe or some material formula. And I'm then you have to play formula. the whole damn thing over again. Do you want to do that? Well, yes. you, don't, you don't have to. Not the whole Ooh, just butterfly sort of spot. Go after the part you missed. See, look at that. They're like right next to me and they don't do anything. And I can cancel their fireballs. Oh, they do little cartwheels. That's cute. They cartwheel attack thing. Nice. Hey, material. I was glad to see that. Put a map in. Now, how much? How many of Phazos take uh, take into the the Napple? Happy it's Napple 18. Day. Eighteen. It's eighteen for a Napple. One Napple seed will give you two Napples if you give it all eighteen. And do some recipes require you to actually have rotten apples? No. no. Wait. I think Maybe. so. Yeah, there there's there's some I think there's some in the cafe that require like a rotten map. Oh, no, no, you found There me. aren't any alcohol. Oh no, gas human. Look, don't tell anyone that I'm not telling you. I'll let you buy something. A scary witch. <laughs> and one day, I'm here too. I'm here too. Freaking gaff. Gaff, gaff, gaff. Well, if you didn't get one before, this guy will sell you the fireproof charm. And by the time you get here, you should really be interested in one. I am interested in more material. I am low on it. Oh, I thought you were going to buy another big bag. I was like, but you don't nah, have I would money. have to sell almost my whole inventory to do that at this point. And then it would be awful, because when you go and arrive to go and buy things, then, you know, at, at, you know, recipeing and, you know, gourmeting, then you don't have enough money to gourmet. You're just like some poor son of a bitch, you know? You don't want to do that. You want to be able to go to the party. Oh, you can't pick it up. Oh. There he is. Wow, there's so many of them. Yeah. In one place, it's very convenient of them. They're randomly placed throughout the whole ring. It can be really frustrating if you're looking for a very specific Madrigora. Mm. Yes. For example, oh, man, the you, you onion. To, you need to have some napalm on you. 
the Onion is hard to find around this place because almost all of them are habaneristos. But if you go to the forest of Elrit, then there are Onions all over the place. Isn't habaneristos really fun to say? Say it again, Cat. Habaneristo. Yeah. It's like a combination of habanero and mephisto. Habane Mif mephisto habanero. being the fist that goes into your face when that's you try to eat one. No, that, that's <clears throat> not him. He tempted Faust into the covenant. Oh, really? Yeah. Really? That That is an actual thing? Yes, Mephisto. Wow! Oh, dodged your fire. What you got the, now? The Bible is cool. It's not in the Bible. Oh. <laughs> <Oops>. <laughs> well, I, I should say it's not in most Bibles. <laughs> oh. Right. Ah, she really is uh, being quite aggressive on you. It's good when they're this aggressive. That way they're close to you more often and you get more hits in. And they don't run away. Finish them off before they've had time to summon lots and lots of enemies. You know. Shut her yes. down, Kaz. I think I can just get her. There she goes. <laughs> That's really nice. Nice little effect you got there. Any more? <laughs> It always gets me when, they, when there's that delay there. Yeah, I know. Because sometimes there's an enemy, like, way on the other side of the ring that you hadn't seen. And it, it just sort of, like, it tempts you, you know? You want to go run around, and then you get away from, like, all the exits, and you're like, Oh, no! I have to run all the way back! Hello. Uh, this is the most miserable. Look at all these assholes. Big bouncing I mean, anuses. <laughs> Look, <laughs> they were just poor in that way. It's too bad they don't, you know, when they explode, like damage them. They were born as spiteful volcanic jack o' lantern anuses. <laughs> yes. Well, I have no respect. Well, you know what? You're the one who's like, I'm like the king of Vulcan. He's you know. because he's cool. He didn't make these guys unless he did. In which case yes, he he's an did. ass. He will get the thrashing he deserves. Thrashing, I say. He will thrash the, the, the king of hot. That performance there belies how troublesome those guys can be. So. And you grew a chicken. And I you did. killed the chicken. And I left this in because once again... Yeah! I like... <laughs> see, critting chickens is fun. You got a big meaty critical on the chicken. Oh, what's this? Wow, you, wow, you really moved. Oh. Oh, an area that I haven't been to. Let's get it. Delicious. Is it is it full of bossy? Like boss boss? Uh, well, no. There's nope. one more regular area to finish up, and then we can go after boss. Boss 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 boss. A new a new boss song. Well. Yes, yes. It, it's another it's another B word. It's actually the same B word from like a couple episodes again. <laughs> But I, I wanted to mix it up a little bit. Cyclone those, those, those mothers. They seem like a rather good enemy to use Cyclone on. They don't have very many hit points, they come in swarms, they sort of stand there for a while. And they come from one side, and that's kind of nice not to be touched by them and get an S, probably. I'm suspecting an S in this. Because your time was uh, under 30 seconds for that. That was nice. The times to get the S are different for different like, difficulties of enemies or number of waves. But... Boss boss! Yeah! This is useless. It seems the Queen of the Dead has reduced my sword's power. My body is like lead. To be defeated by a newborn dragon like this. This doesn't look good. Oswald! Huh? Why are you here? And we're buried, you know? It. I can't go on. Long. <laughs> 
Yet again, Gwendolyn this one, uh, leaps in and attacks someone to, to come on the scene. Yes, this one is a troublemaker. Levinthin is really annoying. He's not that difficult, but... Okay, see that fire blast and how it's going across the entire freaking screen? You want to stay close to him. Because that goes a really, really long way. You're not going to be able to, like, avoid it. Because he also has a huge one. Look at that. That entire white area is damaged. Nice. See, that was half my health. That one hit. Yeah, overloaded. If you do enough damage to him, like so, that is, like, so, there we go. He comes You'll to the die. ground and, and charges with a crown out. It turns out that crown will be important later. And it's uh, one of the sources of his power and one of the reasons he's so difficult. Wow, you beat him quick, Kaz. Well, That's he, the quickest I've seen it. He actually doesn't have that much power. Uh, I mean, defense is really... Mm. It has plenty of power. Shit. His injuries are grave. They must be attended to immediately. See what his pride has cost him. Leave him be. You have been banished for disgracing your country, but you are still astonishing. To be able to defeat the dragon from the prophecies, you intrigue me even more. Oswald has fought for you, and the dragon has been defeated. We are returning to the castle. Why? Why him? That man has been selected by the Queen of the Dead. He will eventually die as her servant. His very existence is torment. Leave that doomed soul and take my hand. Your Majesty, if you persist in insulting my husband, my spear will take your hand. If you do not want your life extinguished, get out of my sight! <laughs> I like this oh, one. intense. Just like a flame. I shall pay my respects to such intensity and back down for now. The promise has been kept. Let us leave it at that. But remember, you are the one that stokes the embers of my heart. <laughs> 